Rapid Framing System Installation Step 1. Foundation Installation Prefabricated permacolumn foundations with integrated metal brackets are installed below the frost line on top of composite or concrete foundation pads. Step 2. Laminated Post Installation the posts are installed by machinery or by hand using a level and screws for vertical adjustments. The posts are nail laminated 3-ply 2x6s or 2x8s, depending on the building size and calculated loads. Step 3. RFS Wall Panel Installation the RFS wall panels are exterior girts with integrated bracing and CCA-treated skirt board. Install two screws per joint at each post and horizontal girt, adjusting the horizontal level of a panel to the floor level marks. Pre-drill the concrete columns for attaching the skirt board. The skirt board will serve as a level and batter board for the future concrete floor. Install the rest of the panels in the same way. At the corners of the building, Use OSB spacers that are equivalent to the thickness of the bracket and the bolt head. In the same way, install the top RFS panels with the integrated truss supports. Use straps if needed to make tighter connections. Install the rest of the top panels in the same way. Step 4. Preparation for the roof components. Install the temporary bracing along one sidewall, making sure it is plumb. Install all the bolts into the metal brackets. Install the truss support boards on the inside of the walls. Use the number and type of screws as specified in the drawings. Install additional truss tie-downs between the posts. Step 5. Roof Truss Installation Install trusses by hand or using machinery, depending on the building size. First, attach one end of the truss to the wall which was just plumbed. Then attach the other end of the truss, adjusting the plumbness of the opposite wall according to the length of the truss. The first and the last trusses must be installed on the exterior sides of the posts. Connect the trusses with temporary bracing at the top cord and the bottom cord, and the permanent bracing as per the drawing and industry standards. Step 6. RFS Roof Panel Installation Install fascia board so it will serve as a starter for the roof panels. Install the nailer board in places where the RFS roof panels will be connected together. Install the RFS roof panels, putting the number and the type of screws as indicated in the drawings. Install the remainder of the RFS roof panels in the same way. Now the structure is ready for the roofing and siding materials.